CrowdMic powers audience interaction by turning phones into wireless microphones. If you're a professor, an AV professional, or a corporate event planner, CrowdMic will engage your audience. We're seeing event planners embracing CrowdMic because it is adding the X factor to their events. CrowdMic powers audience interaction with three key features. The audience can answer live polls, they can text their questions or comments, and we also turn phones into wireless microphones. I mean, what are we doing today, right? We're running microphones around the room, we're putting mics in the aisles, we are yelling from our seats. Now we just simply ask the audience to tap the request to talk button. You'll notice that the moderator can see who's requested to talk. The moderator taps Lori's name and you'll notice her phone lights up and turns blue. And now Lori is talking into her phone and is heard out of the sound system in the room. It's like we just handed her a microphone. That we're doing with AW that you are getting the that is the power of the CrowdMic's microphone. Now, just as easily, I can tap to turn that microphone off, and then I can switch over to Brett, and then to Kara. I'm passing the microphone at light speed. Trust, no titles, everybody's in this together. What is sort of the number one initiative on your list? The US and isolationism in general in the world. I just really wanted to use the microphone, yeah. so. <laughs> The CrowdMic's microphone is the most efficient and effective way for an audience to be heard. However, most people are deathly afraid of microphones. So we allow the audience to text questions and comments to the moderator. The text questions come into the moderator in real time and they can simply just swipe and delete those that are not relevant or those that are redundant. But perhaps I wanna push those to the presentation screen. I can do so by just tapping on the star. Now that's an effective way for the entire audience to see what's on screen. However, we see more often than not that the moderator isn't necessarily the person on stage. They may be backstage, the presenter is on stage, and instead of teaching them the CrowdMics platform, we simply put the presentation screen on the confidence monitor. This is a very effective way for a presenter and moderator to be able to handle a Q&A session. CrowdMics offers live polling, audience response. Let's go ahead and send it to the audience. You'll notice it takes over the audience screens. They respond by tapping on their screen. And in real time, I can see the results populating both for the moderator as well as up on the big screen. After the session has ended, you can see everything that happened using CrowdMic's analytics. This shows you all the people who requested to talk, all of the text comments that were submitted, and the results of the live polls. When you use CrowdMic's, the audience is just interacting. That's our goal. We want the audience to interact in a way that feels natural, and we do it with the phone they already have. Give your audience a voice with CrowdMics.